Hey there, friends. Thanks for checking in. The question for today is, do you prefer magazine-fed shotguns? What I have here are two 12-gauge shotguns, both magazine-fed, also known as box-fed shotguns. Right here is a Remington 870 DM. The DM stands for detachable magazine, comes with two six-round magazines, and this is the Magpul edition. There are several different models with the DM series, but it has an SGA adjustable stock, and excess ghost ring rear sight connected to an all metal rail 18 and a half inch barrel comes with two magazines I already mentioned that an m lock 4n also made by magpul there is your front dot and a ported choke very nice shotgun does have a cross bolt safety right there and it has performed great for me since i've owned it real happy with it and once again it's a box fed magazine shotgun but over here we have a, a rock island armory vr80 this is a semi-auto shotgun that has ar like control so we've got the polymer stock here it does have an aluminum lower receiver and an aluminum handguard uh, five round magazines and it also comes with flip up sights the rail is metal okay and here's your front flip up sight also comes with three chokes i've got a modified in there right now and then there is a barrel shroud this comes with a five round magazine it does come with two but also you can purchase separately a nine or a 19 round magazine and that's what i have here this will accept two and three quarter inch shells and i've got 19 loaded up right now so we're going to check those out we're going to take a few shots with both of these but is this your preference you know it does have some advantages considering quick mag reloads is the primary advantage also you could stagger your rounds in the mag you could do that with two fed shotguns too but here you could do it in advance and many people find that to be an advantage let's start with the remington 870 dm six round magazines very easy to load the first three shells will be double up buck shot with nine pellets followed by seven and a half shot target loads six rounds Fioki high velocity seven and a half shot bird loads. Wow, this thing is a beast. Really handles well. And I like the Magpul edition. I think it looks cool and it's very functional. That ghost ring sight that's built into the rail is really nice. And that front dot sticks out a bit very much a warm barrel right now but over here we've got the rock island armory vr80 i've got a target about 10 yards away it's about to fall any second now and i know that it will because uh it's just taking so much abuse with all these shotgun loads but i like to flip up sights i like everything about this it has a great feel to it and it's a gas piston semi-auto shotgun so it de definitely cuts down on some of the recoil well, let's go ahead and fire this a few times see what you think nice and then like i said it's ar-ish as far as the controls are concerned but what we have here is a 19 round magazine it will accept two and three quarter inch shells both these models will accept three inch loads by the way not sure i mentioned that but check that out that is a magazine to write home about 19 rounds many years ago the saiga models were primarily the shotguns that you would expect to have a box fed magazine now they're all over the place but we're going to go ahead and check this out, see if it'll fire all 19 rounds. Woo. And it did. 
Very nice deal. So do you like the magazine fed shotguns? I think they're pretty awesome. This Remington 870DM is a nice shotgun, pump action, and it sure does perform well. They have um, semi-auto shotguns as well called the V3 uh, with the Versa port system. I've got the tactical model that I'm going to be reviewing shortly, and I'm super excited about that because that Versa port system is nice. This here has what is labeled over on the, the bolt called a buffer bolt system. It really cuts down on the recoil. The <laughs> handguard got a bit warm there because of just the constant firing. But you can see that the rail there, even up here, there's a rail. You can adjust that front sight wherever you want. But what an awesome shotgun both of these are. There is a fine example of two very nice box-fed 12-gauge shotguns. Let me know if you prefer the magazine-fed shotguns or the tube-fed side-by-side, over-under, single-shot, whatever the case. As long as we're talking about shotguns, we're having a great day. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs-up button. Thanks for watching, and you guys be safe.